Right, hi guys, and uh, this is next instalment. This is a Zulu Army, as promised, 6mm Bacchus miniatures. Um, nice miniatures, as usual, from Bacchus. Get these in focus for you. So, riflemen, my skirmishers. Got four stands of those. A little bit of terrain on those bases to make it look like they're taking cover. And then all the impies are the same pose, but they're painted with dark shields to represent the junior regiments. I've got four four junior regiments. And then we've got your married Zulus, your main body of the Zulu army. And I've given these tan shields rather than piebald pattern shields, just because it's hard to distinguish between the different types on the battlefield at 6 mil. But uh, nice detail in the miniatures. We've got uh, five of those. And then we've got, um, again, same pose, but white shields. And these could represent Kitsueo's Royal Impi. Uh, we've got slightly different fighting characteristics, a bit tougher. So that's the... Uh, those are the senior impies, and there's three of those. And then we've got your command stands, <clears throat> and the command figures are much the same, but I've based them slightly different to denote seniority, so the ones on pennies are junior commanders. And then we've got your generalissimo, or your uh, CNC, and this could be Kitsweo himself, or Prince Mablini, um, and he's popped him on a suitably high rocky outcrop so you can see the battlefield and he's easy to spot so that's it guys um, hope you enjoyed that the Zulus certainly fought well last night um, gave the British a good pasting yeah so pretty pleased with those I'll be taking them out for a, another run next week, see how they do then. So thanks for watching guys, and um, next video, probably going to be my uh, Dogs of War Army for Warmaster. Um, and then I've got another job on, I'm painting the crew of Serenity um, for, a, for a guy. So I might put those on, commit those to film before I give them over to the customer. So thanks for watching, and uh, I'll see you soon.